Good morning, everybody. I'm Brian, and you're watching Someplace or Another. And today I'm in Elkhart, Indiana, at the RV Hall of Fame. So let's go check it out. Interesting. This is an old one. This one's huge. TV in here. Huh. A nice little overview shot of what we will be seeing later. Alright. Let's go. The American Journey. The all-American family experience of travel with a home on wheels. Well, I gotta get started somewhere. Might as well start with Earl. A travel trailer hooked to a Model T. A telescoping apartment hooked to a Model T. And originally sold for 100 bucks. I think the house car is the way to go. You won't get anywhere in a hurry, but you'll get there in style. And it's nice. Like an old timey apartment. Those seats are pretty sketchy though. I think house car is a fitting title. Looks like the car ran into a house. Well, we have a 34 Comfort Trailer. It looks pretty comfortable. This one's taller inside. Hmm, tent camper. Just six steps. Yeah, it looks like a tent. I should call this video Tiny Home Tours, because that's what I'm doing. So this was a prototype. Hmm. Looks like an 85 from up here. I like the aluminum finish. Hmm. 
It's kind of hard to get all of them in the shot. This has got to be the best looking RV in the place. What do you think? This one's totally cool. Definitely my favorite. It's a lot smaller on the inside. <laughs> The bathroom. Oh man, well, that's clever. Hmm. More style than function. Hmm. I didn't even realize that was a trailer. This 29 covered wagon was the first production travel trailer in the United States. Hmm. It's actually pretty nice in here. My West house car. Very nice. Looks mostly the same. Green Day porch. Cool. Another travel trailer. Very nice. A little bitty one. Nice fifties colors. Actually, for something so small, it's pretty roomy. All right, this is cool. Wow. There's no headroom in here. Looks roomy though. Hmm. Oh, the Studebaker. That's a truck to pull with. <laughs> it's like your living room in here. Sewing machine. Little table. This is huge. I like the floor plan's open. Almost a full-size fridge. 
General Electric. I mean, seriously, this thing's huge. I'd want to pull it, but it's like a house in here. It's nice. Thirty-four camp car. It's kind of like a modern day van camping, space wise. Don't think I've shown a truck camper yet. Hmm, actually, quite a bit of room. It doesn't ride like a truck. And it doesn't look like a box. 74. <laughs> you track player. <laughs> really played Herb Albert and the Tijuana Brass. I actually know that album. from Winnebago. I can see why it was popular. Lots of room. Open feel. Bunk beds. Yeah, I'm sure it's bottom one folds out. Let's see what kind of new RVs they have. But first, one more old one. Hmm. Thought we were done with the old ones. This one smells old. Old and new. Ford chassis. <laughs> I can tell I bought the steering wheel. Very roomy. This is one, I believe, is new, made to look old.
Hmm. Actually, it looks old inside, except new, like it was constructed similar. With the plywood drawer fronts. Well, I hope you enjoyed the video. I'll see you someplace or another. Bye. Don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe. All right. Well, now I'll see you later. Bye. Stay tuned for more adventure to come. Subscribe, like, share, and thanks for watching. Bye.